Welcome back to my channel. I'm Russell Mack and today I have a fragrance I want to talk to you about. It's from the house uh, Ocean Specific actually. Okay, a woody um, oriental fresh and spicy fragrance. So listen, stay tuned and I'll be right back with the fragrance preview. Right? Peace. Alright, alright, alright. beautiful frag family I hope all is well with you and today I'm talking about another fragrance from Ocean Specific also known as OP okay there's another video I did uh, about this house and it's a woman's fragrance or should I say unisex calls called Sun or simply Sun feel free to look through my videos and check it out all right now today we're talking about a 2004 release. The nose behind this fragrance is John Lewis Grobby, okay? And it is OP Black for him or the parfum. Here's the bottle. And this is a clear bottle in the front with white right. OP for him. The whole bottle is black because of the picture right here, okay? Um, it's the picture, the color, well, it looks like a black sea or ocean. Let your imagination run wild with you, all right? With a copper or, or, or brown, this top is very snug, in colored plastic top. This is that thick plastic, though, all right? Um, let me find the itemizer so I can give you a little spritz, all right? That's the itemizer, as you see. Okay, now let's talk about the way this fragrance smell. Okay, now let me remind you that this is older parfum concentrate. And before I talk about the notes of the fragrance or how it smells, this fragrance costed me right at $16. Okay, it's $14 but I bought it with a whole bunch of other fragrances, so of course I paid tax on all of those fragrances. If you check Fragrance X and Fragrance Net, you will find this fragrance, which is a 100 mil, um, a 3.4, okay, in size. I love the square bottle. It's a classy looking bottle, sleek, and it gives the illusion that it's all black, okay, when in actuality, it's clear, okay? Uh, <clears throat> Fragrance X has it for, for $16 and some change. So actually, it's cheaper in the rack store than it would be on Fragrance X, okay? Because it's $16 and then you have the taxes, okay? Depending on where you are in the US. Then Fragrance Net have it for $16.09 with tax, okay? The original price, I believe, was $22, okay? So you got all of the information you need to decide on whether or not you want to purchase this fragrance. It's not expensive either way you go, but your local rack store or Burlington, if you have one in your city, then check Burlington and they may actually have OP for him Eau de Parfum, okay? Now, this fragrance opens up with notes of Cassius, um, tangerine, a honey tangerine, with the freshness of bergamot, bergamot I'm sorry, with um, tomato leaf, which is a note that we don't hear often, y'all. Okay, then you have rose and black pepper in the heart, okay, with sandalwood and patchouli, my God, and balsamic undertone, okay? Now, I've already sprayed it over here on his wrist, let me spray it again for you in the air. I just want to smell the opening for you. That's for you. That's for my, my beautiful frag family. Now, what you get when you open, when you spray this fragrance, you get the bergamot. Oh, it smells so good. You get the honeyed tangerine. You get the astringents from the tomato leaf. It's really astringent. So you get that beautiful honey, honeyed tangerine with, with slight citrus, 
with the freshness of the bergamot along with the tomato leaf, okay? And you also are going to get a little bit, a little hint of the rose with the spiciness from the black pepper, all right? That's the opening. Now, after about the 30 minute mark, don't look for the tangerine and don't look for much of the bergamot. You, you know, around about the, the 30 minute to the hour mark is when you begin to smell that beautiful rose <clears throat> with the creaminess of the sandalwood and the patchouli, okay? I was just talking to my daughter because now she thinks she's a fragrance enthusiast. I guess she's been around me so long um, that now she's starting to pick up notes and, and, and chords and fragrances. And we both agree that after about six hours, because I've been wearing it all day, testing it, it, it actually does smell a, a similar to Pasha de Cartier. I can't believe I'm saying that, but it does because of the balsamic undertones of with the patchouli and the sandalwood, which they both share. And I love the way the dry down smell. This is what you want from this fragrance. The opening is gorgeous, beautiful opening. Nice and heavy, complex, astringent, bold, mature. See, so, so that's, that's beautiful, for this, especially in the fall and winter weather. But what you really want to get to is this beautiful dry down. That rose, okay, with the pepper. You want to get to that creaminess of the sandalwood with the patchouli, and, and, and which is a, which is balsamic. The tomato leaf hangs around for about three to four hours. This stuff is beautiful. It's fresh, clean, heavy, dense. I love it. It, it's it's supposed to remind you of a, uh, um, the, the dark hour on the dark sea. And this is how the sky, or should I say the sea, look when you're out on the boat. Minus, minus light, of course. The water is black and beautiful for miles. And that is what you're supposed to get. The freshness of the water with a hint of vegetation. Uh, uh, with that heavy patchouli, the, the definition of the patchouli, and the creaminess of the sound of wood. This is a beautiful fragrance that I would say, if I didn't know how much it was and I were to smell it, I would think it was a niche fragrance. That's what my girl said when she smelled it, and, and she loves it. She, she said it almost smells of niche quality. Now, we know that there are no, there's no such thing as niche or designer, but just to give you some hint of, of, of how it smells when it begins to unfold and the heavier notes begin to come to the forefront, it, 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 it almost acts as if though it's a niche fragrance and I love it. It's beautiful. It's nice to wear um, during the fall and winter months. Um, who would I say, or what age group? I would say 25 to the age of 30 and on up, um, because I, this is a mature fragrance and, and it's not as playful and youthful as some of the other fragrances. Um, this one here is kind of heavy. Um, now it is a diverse fragrance. I wouldn't say that you would just have to wear it when you're dressed up or casual. You can wear it anytime, okay? We know that fragrance is also subjective, so everybody's not going to like the same thing, okay? But I will say that this is one that you can wear pretty much anytime, okay? Um, but I would, myself personally, this is one I would wear casually and dressed up, okay? Um, is it a unique smell? Well, I would say it is in the opening. But once it gets to the dry down, then you will be reminded of some fragrance. Maybe you may not know exactly which, which fragrance it reminds you of, uh, but it will remind you of something. So I wouldn't say that it was that it is unique, but I will say that it does have a scent profile and scent character of its own that you, when you smell it, you would know that it's OP Black for him. Um, ocean specific, y'all. Okay, so I'll be doing maybe a 10 fragrance video soon um, 
and this would definitely be it, okay? I know I've been bringing to you guys a bunch of fragrances, different fragrances, no, not many niche fragrances, and not really high-end designer fragrances, but I've been finding some cheaper, lower-end fragrances that have been smelling just as good, okay? And in the position I'm in right now, that's what I have to do, and it works, okay? And I smell just as good as anybody wearing Parfums de Marley Cree or any other high-end or niche fragrance, okay? So, I like it. I like it. If you haven't smelled this fragrance, get your hands on it. For the price, the smell is outstanding, okay? It's, it's a grown-up fragrance. Uh, it's a little different than what you used to smelling, okay? Uh, but it still has freshness. It still has quality. It's still mature, okay? And it's a nice-looking bottle, too. I like the OP bottles because a lot of them come just like this. They have the picture in the back of the bottle, um, and it, it shows throughout the entire bottle, okay? Clear bottle, really nice fragrance, okay? So that's my that's been my take on Ocean Specific Black for him. I, I, I talked about in the last video I did about Ocean Specific that I wanted to get more into this house. And thank God I found one in Burlington. Burlington, uh, I think Burlington Store. It used to be called Coke Factory, but now it goes under the name Burlington, and they have a lot of fragrances that I hadn't saw in years, okay? And this is one that I like, okay? A 2004 um, offering from OP. Um, so, you know, this fragrance is 16 years old. So I would call it a legend in the game. You know, an OG in the game. Been around for a while, and it still smells good. Still, still smells modern. It could compete with any fragrance out there right now, okay? So this is one I'll be wearing for fall and winter. Get your hands on it, give it a try, okay? If you have worn this fragrance, though, I would love to hear what you think about it, whether you like it or not, all right? Um, <clears throat> if you don't know about this fragrance, still want you comment, okay? Get your hands on it, okay? This is Black For Him by OP, okay? Uh, well, I'm done, ladies and gentlemen. If you are new to Solomon's Vineyard, why don't you become a part of the family? And go ahead and subscribe. Hit the notification bell and tap on all so that you get all fragrance content from this channel. I need your likes, your dislikes, your comments, your sin of the day, okay? Any of those good things. Now, I am on... Uh, Instagram, I am right at a hundred followers. So go over to Instagram and follow Dark Rider 761. Also check me out on Facebook at Russell Mack. I, I have content there also. Okay, I'm finished. I didn't want to take too long. I love you and I'm praying for you. Keep me in your prayers. All right. I, I thank you for being a part of the family. Thank you so much. I'm gone, I'm gone ladies and gentlemen. That has been. My take on OP, black for him, older parfum. All right, take care of yourself. Peace, y'all.